fractions also exist in the binary just as they do in the decimal system. I'm gonna do a side by side comparison binary here, decimal here. Maybe divide the sheet somewhere there. Let's do a super easy fraction. How about uh, three quarters? Three quarters in decimal looks like this in binary. Now notice that that 3 is just a normal whole number 3 and that's just a normal whole number 4. So to make a fraction in decimal 3 is written as 1 1. The first 1 in the 1's place value, the second 1 in the 2's place value, 1 meh. 1 at the 2's and 1 at the 1's so that's 3. And 4 is written as 100. Zero, zero. If we want to make equivalent fractions, so these two are the same things. If we want to do equivalent fractions in this one, say let's let's double it. That would be 2 times 3 is 6, and 2 times 4 is 8. There. 6 8 is the equivalent fraction of 3 quarters. Uh, same worth, same value just higher numbers, much like inflation. Nothing changes substanti substantially, just you see higher numbers. If you want to double the digits on this one, you have to do the same, times two. Now two is not a digit available, you write two this way in binary. And uh, have to keep in mind, when you see that, you have to say two times three. Just like when you see dot curly line and not curly line, you say two times three, and in your head you're making, the, uh, you're coming up with the answer six. The concept of six, and in decimal system you make that curly line to mean the concept of six. So here you see that you see that two times three equals six, and six is written as that in the binary system because these are the ones, those are the twos, those are the fours. So that's four, five, six, oops, overboard. That's how it's written, six. And that's six, and uh, that's not 100, that, that is four. Four times two is eight, and eight is written like so. So that equivalent fractions in binary and decimal, and you can also add fractions to this six eighths. We can add another one eighth and we come up with an answer of seven eighths and the same happens in binary we can add to six eighths we can add one more eighth which is written as one eighth because that one is in the eight eight place value and you just add them up and there the answer is seven eighths. So now that is seven and that is eight. Fairly straightforward. Fractions work in binary as well.